Audio Jungle. Federal Executive Council approved a memorandum by the Ministry of Budget and Economic Planning, which was presented by the Director General of the Budget Office on the medium term expenditure framework and fiscal strategy paper for 2025 to 2027. And the memo seeks Council's approval for the medium term expenditure framework for submission to the approval for submission to the National Assembly. And the uh, Federal Executive Council graciously, upon listening to the Director General, Tanimi Akubu, approved the 2025 2027 medium term expenditure framework, which, as required, by the Fiscal Responsibility Act of 2007. The medium-term expenditure framework started with a macroeconomic background, which acknowledged that despite challenging uh, conditions in the global economy, Nigeria was able to, Nigeria's economy has turned in the right direction achieving a gross, positive growth rate in two quarters continuously, significantly, uh, with the growth rate of 3.19% in real terms in the second quarter of 2024. However, it acknowledged that the government will continue to tackle inflation, strengthen economic resilience, support the vulnerable, and rebuild fiscal buffers. The and support to high employment generation sectors improve the business environment and effective implementation of youth development and social investment programs. It also included a review of the 2024 budget implementation, where it acknowledged that a review of the implementation of the federal government 2024 budget reveals promising progress in revenue collection and expenditure management. Despite lags in prorated targets, the overall trajectory so shows that fiscal efforts are on track with key non-oil streams performing better than anticipated. Equally, it included parameters for the 2025-2027 medium term fiscal framework, which include an oil price benchmark of $75 a barrel for 2025, oil production of 2.06 million barrels a day, as well as an exchange rate of 1,400 naira to a dollar, and GDP growth of 4.6%. The it is expected that for, 20, for 2025, the federal government's budget estimate is, is uh, the aggregate expenditure is estimated at 47 trillion. And this includes a borrowing of 13.8 trillion, which is 3.87% of the estimated 
GDP. And it includes projections, especially for the first time, provisions for contribution to the development commissions that have been passed by the National Assembly or are in the process of being passed by the National Assembly. And equally, the fiscal objectives were conservative because we want to ensure that we steady the course much as we believe the projections will be exceeded. The budget size that was approved for presentation to the National Assembly in the MTEP is 47.9 trillion with new borrowings of 9.22 trillion to finance the budget deficit in 2025, as well as noting that we need to sustain the market deregulation, commendable market deregulation of petroleum prices and exchange rate, and to compel the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation Limited to lower its oil and gas production cost significantly and even to consider the need to amend the relevant sections of the Petroleum Industry Act 2021 to address the significant risk to Federation Revenue. The, 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 the Federal Executive Council approved the fiscal, sorry, the medium term expenditure framework and the fiscal strategy paper and it will be submitted to the National Assembly. This in addition to bills that are already at the National Assembly, the uh, economic stabilization bills and tax reform bills, which we believe we will have a very, very uh, strong growth in 2025. Thank you. Audio jump.